Hey, what's up, what's up? How you doing? This time we have one uh, tree head Yamaha Natural Sound Stereo Cassette Deck KX630 and as you can see it's in silver color and it looks so elegant and nice and, and classy and, and uh, everything. I never had to tell you the true proper silver cassette deck so this would be my first one that I uh, serviced I replaced the belt basically with the original one uh, the closest that I could find in these days so yeah this is really something I mean visually and the sound is good not to mention the deck also had a remote controller which is for some people very important and the um, look is you know like i mean there are some scratches and stuff like that normal so let's power it on and see the most beautiful display on cast <laughs> all right i know many of you would not agree with me but this is one of the most beautiful peak meters and display on Casadex from this age so let's see what is three head Casadex can offer to some future uh, user of course power button phones large phones input and the level knob so you can properly you know adjust your uh, phone level headphones level uh, the mechanism is pretty much simple it's not dual capstan but it's in mint condition as you can see it's very very clean and i have to mention of course amorphous heads hx pro which is kind of standard of this casadex so the first thing that you will notice is like a large slider this would be your master fader but in these days we cannot say that word master so youtube will already uh, censor my video if i said master uh, or slave because master and slave if you use hard drives in old days you would have a master drive and slave drive and we have master fader, but we don't have slave fader, so I don't know, it's stupid. It's just a you know, technical you know, language that we got used to. But okay, no more slaves, no more masters uh, in, new comp <laughs> in new technology, but the old technology still has it. So when you adjust your recorder level, like I did here, so it kind of jumps nicely. You can then adjust it like with this, more or less, more or less. And they said like, uh, look at that Dolby symbol. So if you can, you know, follow that Dolby symbol and put your peak mirrors around there, you'll be fine. And that's what I'm doing here. All right, besides uh, slider, we have, uh, of course, normal controls, rewind, play, fast forward, recording, pause, stop, mute search. Uh, to demonstrate mute search, I would have to put mm. some of the original tapes, of course, as always, MC Scat Cat. <laughs> I don't know why, but that cassette is always around and it's kind of um, when you want to test all those players, recorders, if the, this cassette sounds good on all of them, then it's going to sound good. <laughs> <coughs> Pardon me. All those old tapes are a little bit noisy. Okay. 
so we don't need Dolby for this. And we're gonna set, I'm gonna put everything on normal. So that would be like original tape. So if you wanna go and, uh, oh yeah. Search for a, it's a noisy tape, I know, but I don't care. All I wanted to find the next track and play it from there. <laughs> and Deck was able to do it. That would be enough for my copyright. So if they catch a couple of seconds of it, you cannot monetize this video, but because I cannot monetize it anyway, I don't care. So I'll put back some stupid, when I say stupid, I mean like a very old, unknown, I don't know the source of the tape and it's vintage and it's used and it's sometimes bad. But I like to test all the decks on the worst tapes. If it can perform on the worst tape, then it will, it will work on much better tapes. <laughs> oh yeah. It sounds crazy. Oh, this is a test on tape. So yeah, the, the rewind and, and a fast forward sounds a little bit. I don't know if it's the tape. I replaced the belt. This is crazy. Let's see if it, if it goes around on the other side. Now it's kind of, yeah, it's noisy. <laughs> it is noisy when you fast forward and rewind. That's what I noticed. And it was a test tape, but now it's gonna be something different. So I'm gonna record on it. And I'm gonna explain, we have a counter uh, reset memory button tape. You're gonna choose 60 minutes, 90 minutes then if it's all right the deck will be able to tell you remain time like it's going showing yeah which was kind of rare at that time uh yeah counter reset memory monitor button very important so you can listen what's recording on the tape i'm gonna turn the dolby b on or c maybe let's record with dolby c and i'm gonna keep my bias knob a little bit on the left so let's see how it records. All right, this is kind of a little bit uh, lower level, but now the bass will come back and then we're gonna see how it goes. Source, tape, source, tape. So maybe I'm gonna put this bias back here. I'm chasing the tape and source to be like a similar yeah this is actually excellent Casa deck the only thing that I would the sound is really good yeah you can pull up from the basic normal tape which is kind of old very good and decent sound. <laughs> the only thing that is like the noisy re rewind. We'll see if we can solve that, but. Yeah, it's very loud. We see, I'm gonna, I'll have to probably address that. But otherwise the sound is really good. I like it.
I mean, not this one. <laughs> but this one is also good because the, I checked the, the, the speed and it's on the point. Yeah, I like the recording with, with, with such a stupid tape and it's kind of really good. Let's see. Yeah, normal tape. <laughs> That's crazy, man. Wow. I'm impressed. Uh, we'll see. I may sell it like this because I don't mind the fast forward and rewind. You see, maybe the tape is bad, but, but probably something uh, needs to be lubricated more. But the belt is replaced, and uh, the thing is, fast forward and rewind is totally uh, different than play. So uh, that's why the play and recording is working like a charm, because it's a different, you know, mechanism that runs one and the other. So for rewind and fast forward, we're using different motor, and for play, we use different motor. Aha, uh -huh. you can hear it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's crunching. <laughs> we'll see. Maybe I'm gonna sell it like this. Maybe I'm gonna address it. It's all about how much time do I have. <laughs> Take care.